What's up guys? It's Friday afternoon and we are gonna go out and do some mushroom hunting. They've been finding a lot recently. We've probably found them around seven eight, pounds. seven pounds. So me and my brother are heading out right now. We're gonna go see if we can find piles of mushrooms. This one is like dried up. This one's been knocked over. And yeah, there's more. I'm just gonna start making a pile. Nice one. See another one. That's a big egg. I think that's a turkey. Just like sitting here. You see an egg? Yeah. By itself? Yeah, it's cracked open. Something probably ate it. Oh. Fox might have got it. And I think it's a turkey. Just sitting here. They're just like throughout this whole area. Oh, there's another one. Here's two that are almost gone. Another one. Couple more. That's a good one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's even got egg yolk on it. Egg yolk. Must have been a... Rest in peace, little guy. Oh, here's one that I think Micah probably squished. I'm There's sure. like some really tiny ones. I think I might have just found the tiniest one in the whole world. No, you didn't. I found tinier ones. How do you know? You didn't even see it. I know, but I know I found tinier ones. So far. Not a ton, but... A good little bit. There's got to be more. There does. <laughs> Leaf in my face. Just cleaned up the patch. I have more. These we actually found by a dead elm tree. Look at that. Shocker. Classic. I don't believe that crap, but hey. Then why do you... There's all... This place where they're all growing, there's like a grove of dead elm trees. Yeah, that's the thing. Everybody's like... Oh yeah, they grow by elm trees. But actually, maybe look anywhere in Wisconsin. Pretty much anywhere you're going to find mushrooms, there's probably an elm tree somewhere close by, so you, you could always say there. that. <laughs> Maybe like mushrooms grow in the same area as elm trees, like no. I, yeah, that might, I mean, I could see that, but I don't think there's any science behind. I mean, I prove know. me wrong, but I don't oh, know. More. That's just, I don't, I don't see the science behind growing by dead elm trees. Alright, so we are going to move on. See if we can find some other spots. Great. Ouch. 
These are the brown, crumbly ones. That was a fawn. Jumped him up like right in here somewhere. I hate doing that. But it's that time of year. Aha, I thought there had to be something up here. These nice brown ones, at least one. I just found some really big ones. These are not them, but I see them. And I had spotted some more, so I don't want to lose them either. Check that one out. I'm running out of hand space. It's a big patch I've got here. I might have to actually put the camera away and just pick them and then show you guys. I think that's what I'm gonna do. There's a lot and they're big. Check out this handhold. I mean, hand, handful. Why can't I talk? Well, I think I'm done for the night. I found uh, maybe half a Walmart bag, probably. I'd say I got at least two pounds in here. It's a pretty good haul. Maybe could have found more if I would have kept looking, but I think I'm done. Anyway, I will take these back to the house and combine them with my brothers. I don't know if he's back yet. We kind of parted ways there. And we will show you what we got. So I would say we had a pretty good haul there. Um, it was just uh, over two pounds. Actually, what I had in my bag was two pounds, and what Isaiah had was like almost, I don't know, it was only like 0 .2, which it looked a lot more than that. It looked like a lot more than that. But, it was pretty good. I think some of them are, some of them are over the hill a little bit. Like, you can see, pretty brown. A lot of browns in there. But these are some of those probably one of the bigger ones I found actually this one might be the, the tallest one I found but there's still a few grays well not a whole lot I mean it's got some brown too so I don't know I think they're just about over the hill actually they only started we had such a weird spring and they never came up till like just maybe over a week ago, a little bit over a week ago. We started finding them and it got hot so fast. Like this week it's been in the 80s or like right around 80. I think it might be a short year this year for the mushrooms. 
Yeah, I don't know. I mean, one thing I noticed was a lot of them that we found were on north slopes. Actually, all of them are on north slopes. So normally you find them on southern slopes first, obviously, and then kind of goes to northern. So I, I think we're, I don't know, there might be another week of them. But I think it's pretty much, it's winding down here. So I don't know if we'll get out and look for much more. We might get some. But I'm ready to go fishing and do some other stuff. Hoping this weekend we can go trout fishing and I'm actually thinking maybe we will go up to the cranberry bogs up north and do some panfish and bass. Hopefully I can make that happen. It'd be awesome if we could do that and we'll bring it all to you guys right here on YouTube and bring you guys along with us. Watch for those videos coming up. I'm hoping to do more vlogs. I was this spring, I did a the first vlog, kind of just a whatever I do, off-season vlog. And man, I was hoping to do them like every month at least. Well, actually I was hoping to do it like every other week, so like every two weeks. Man, I've just kept been so busy with work and everything. I just, it's been two months since that last one. So yeah, I, I need to get on it and do more. So hopefully we can do some fishing vlogs coming up and then we're heading to the boundary, Minnesota boundary water in three weeks. So we're gonna be doing a lot of fishing up there. We're gonna bring that to you guys. And then we're going on a charter trip on Lake Michigan for uh, lake trout and stuff. So we got a lot going on. Hopefully you guys don't get tired of fishing. Yeah, anyway, if you enjoyed this video, hopefully there's gonna be more. I really am gonna try to get some more vlogs out so just subscribe to our channel and like this video It'd be, we'd really love that if you do that and keep watching for more